Hey everyone, it's Chrisley at ActoGames.com here, and today we're doing another super simple but super cool demonstration on how water is the coolest substance on Earth. So one of our fans recommended The Physics Girl, and she is really, really cool. Thank you for recommending The Physics Girl. A link to her channel will be right up there. She is really cool. She has quite a few really cool experiments, and she went to MIT, and I'm representing MIT with my t-shirt. MIT is one of the coolest schools in the world. I really hope I'll be able to go there someday and, you know, go to school there someday. It's really cool, and I have my own t-shirt for it. So we were looking at her channel, and we watched this experiment, and we've seen quite a few science experiments in our lives, but we've never seen this one before, and it's really cool. And we really loved it, so we tried it out at home. I'm like, whoa, that's cool. We have to share it with you guys. So today, I'm going to be sharing that science experiment with you guys. And this is super simple, and all you need for it is a ballpoint pen with a spring, a glass of water, and some dish soap or dishwashing detergent. So the first step is to take apart your pen and take out this little spring, which makes the, spr which makes the pen retract and stuff with the clickiness and stuff. So take it out, and here you have it. So the next step is to take a glass of water. You should probably use a clear glass so you can see what's going on. And very, very lightly place the spring on top of the water. And as you can see, it floats. Watch what happens if I drop it in the water. It sinks. So you may be wondering what's happening here, why when I put it gently on the water it floats, but why when I drop it in the water it sinks. And the truth is, it doesn't ever float at all. It sits on a little film kind of on top of the water we call surface tension, which is all the water down in the glass is being pulled in all different directions because water is polar, so it's attracting to each other and it's pulling all in different directions. But the water on top, there's no water on top of it, so it's just being pulled down, which makes it come back together a lot more. And that makes sort of a film on top of the glass. So if you put it very, very gently on the film, then it'll just sit on the film. It's not floating it's just gonna sit gently on the film and it looks like it's floating it's not floating like Archimedes principle it's not displacing enough water to be buoyant it's just sitting on top of that film and you might be wondering what I'm talking about there a long time ago I made a video on how Archimedes principle works and buoyancy and displacement there'll be a link to that on the end card We've also talked about surface tension before in some of our Steve Spangler vlogs, like the Steve Spangler magic tricks. There'll be a link to those on the end card as well. So it's just surface tension. It's a film on top of the water, kind of, that the spring is sitting on. But if I drop it and it breaks through that film, then it sinks to the very bottom. So that's cool in itself that the spring displays surface tension. If you put it lightly on the water, it floats, kind of. And if you drop it, it sinks. But there's a cooler thing to this, and there's other ways to break surface tension other than dropping it or pushing on it. And one of those ways is using just a tiny bit of soap, because soap, what it does is it keeps water from bonding to itself a little bit, so it just kind of repels water apart. So one end is hydrophilic, which means it loves water, so it attaches to the water molecules, but the other end is hydrophobic, so it's repelling the water molecules. And these tiny molecules are soap, are all connecting to most of the water on the surface, so it's making it all repel from each other a little bit, and that just completely breaks the surface tension. So watch what happens if I put the tiniest bit of soap in the water with a spring floating on top. So the spring is floating on the water. Now I'm going to take the tiniest, tiniest bit, the tiniest bit I can of this dishwashing detergent. I'm going to put it pretty much as far away as I can from the spring and leave my finger in the water and watch what happens. So ready? Oh, I should probably put it over here so you can see. So that's really cool. So the surface tension is breaking, and that's what the spring is sitting on top of. So once it breaks, it just falls straight through. Like if you're sitting on a chair and the chair breaks, you're going to fall on the ground. So basically the spring is sitting on the surface tension and it breaks, so it falls to the ground. So this is super duper simple. You only need a couple of things, which you'll probably have lying around your house. It's great. It's just amazing. I bet you'll be amazed by how cool this is and how simple the experiment is to perform. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you to the physics girl for showing us this. We've seen quite a few physics experiments in our life. We've seen a lot of them. And this is the first time we've ever seen this one. And it's just amazing 
definitely try it at home. Post in the comments below what you thought about it. You'll definitely be amazed by it. So yeah, thank you for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow.